So, is Mika really dead? Up wedding nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Awari no Seraph, aka Seraph of the End, chapter 91. So, last chapter, it really, on the surface it looks like Mika is dead, but the thing is, and I'm glad that we're getting all these comments in my comment section that, um, that I don't think Mika is going to die. I think in all reality, Mika is going to resurrect as a serf, uh, as a seraph, and for me, um, I think one of the conditions for Mika to be able to do this was to get all the vampire blood out of his system, and to, uh, you know, to basically die um, as a vampire, so then he can resurrect as the seraph he was meant to be. At least that's my opinion. Uh, but I'm really hoping we're getting Mika backstory. Um, this month if not I will kind of be mad but uh, let's get to this chapter and see what's in store for us and this chapters tell orphan Prince and so far um, I don't think we're getting our makeup backstory but we got we got a sexy ass uh, Fred on the cover I'm down with, I'm always down with Fred on the cover yeah, we're not I don't think we're getting Mika backstory this month. I, I, which I'm really pissed off about. Why wouldn't you get, like, this is the perfect time for Mika backstory. With how last chapter ended, this is, like, the time for Mika backstory. The, sh the fuck is this shit? <sighs> well, Fred is on the cover, so if we get some Fred Crowley bromance awesomeness this, ch this month, you know what? I might be able to forgive this chapter because, let's be real, the Fred Crowley bromance is like the best bromance in all of manga. It really is. You cannot deny that bromance being the best fucking bromance in all of manga. So let's go. Retreat, retreat. Our mission is complete. Uh, pull back. Hurry. Don't let any Hyakia sect operatives escape. Pursue and capture them. There they are. There's my men. But, but why does Fred have long hair again? Where's my short-haired mans? And wait a second. Something just popped into my head here. Something we don't know about either. Is we don't know about Fred's origins. We know about Crowley's origins, but we don't know about Fred. So I wonder if Fred's origins somehow tie in with with uh, um with Mika somewhere. That'd be interesting. Let's keep going and see if it does. Hmm, hey Crowley. Hey Crowley, I find myself feeling a little peckish. How about you? Yeah, now that you mention it, I am a little thirsty. I did a lot of exercise today. Right! Die, yucky you sex scum! No, you die, demon army bastard! <laughs> I've always preferred uh, children's blood, but you'll have to do. Other, so, do you want his blood, Crowley? <laughs> Didn't you just say we're allies? But the blood of allies you just betrayed is the tastiest kind. <laughs> oh my god. Um, sure you did guzzle, guzzle mine down way back when. <laughs> yeah, I seem to remember that being tasty. Yes, thinking about it, it was delicious. I'm gonna drink it again. Um, turn back into a human so I can. <laughs> Possible. Oh, is yours still tasty, I wonder? Maybe I'll have a sip and see. I wouldn't if I were you. Try it and I'll, I'll drink your blood. Oh, really? That could be fun. What do you desire? What, do you desire me now? Okay, do it. Drink my blood. Drink so much you nearly kill me. No way, actually kill me. Oh, God. Like, Crowley's like, like, look at, like, what the fuck? What the fuck are you talking about? What the fuck am I supposed to do with that? Tracks 
on the concrete, uh, like long chains dragged in the dirt. Uh, can you stop with the jokes now? Let's do what we're here for. Have you noticed? Yeah, I smell, yes, I smell blood. The same blood that flows in our veins. Father's blood. Ha, yes, it, it's Papa Scent. Boy, this is incredible. Oh, so that motherfucker's still alive. That motherfucker's side is still alive. Boy, this is incredible. Not healing at all. I guess uh, this is what happens when you get hit with a sinful key. Um, will I not be able to get away? My plan isn't complete yet. Papa, oh, Papa, I love you, so I've come to kill you. Fred, you came. So... What's your plan for all this, hmm? Plan? You mean to kill me, yes? To what point? What do you get from it? Good question! Point? He's asking what the point is. Um, what do you think of that, Crowley? Personally, I think it's the father's duty to teach his sons what the point of living is. Did you learn the point of living from Papa at all? Uh, you forced me a forced me a vial of father's blood, so technically you made me a vampire! <laughs> You should teach it to me, not him! <laughs> but I'm the picture of familiar responsibility. Of course I taught it to you. I was like, what is the point to life? I don't remember you doing that. <laughs> I fucking love this fucking romance, man. Oh, don't lie. You remember I taught it to you over and over. First I started by killing everyone who was important to you. Oh, shit. Ah, but dis uh, despite that tragedy, the world didn't change one bit. You live and, and, and you live, but nothing changes. Ever the sky can... Uh, 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 oh, sorry, let me read this again. But despite that tragedy, the world didn't uh, change one bit. You live and you live, but nothing changes. Ever. The sky can be blue or black. It doesn't matter. There's no point to living at all. None. At least that's what uh, I taught my son. <laughs> oh, God. If I'm somehow wrong, though, then teach us. And show us what meaning there is to life, Papa. Woo, well, that's fast. I could do that, too, you know. <laughs> that's my man! Woo! Come on, this is dull. Struggling won't get you anything. Let it be over, Papa. Repertory, making you into a vampire was a mistake. It totally was! Sign of <laughs> That was a huge mistake! Because you created a fucking monster. Not just a monster, you created a supreme troll god, man. <laughs> That's what you did. Oh, and what point is there to saying that? First and foremost, you were always abnormal. <gasps> yes, we're getting Fred backstory! Oh my god! Fred, what are you doing? Why is your father dead? What on earth did you do to him? Hi, mother. I love you. He killed his parents? Oh my god, so even before Fred became a vampire, he was a goddamn monster. Aw, uh, I've always been perfectly normal, especially for someone who was second in line for a royal throne. I had such a strict upbringing, they were teaching me to be a saint. What, you a prince? No way. Yes! So Fred was a fucking prince! What? <laughs> That's so crazy! Hey, um, hey, um, hey, Am So, look at me closely. Do I have a princely face? I wouldn't know. <laughs> He'll get my power back. If I focus, I can still... Oh, Fred, not gonna let you do that. So, Papa, I think I've let you buy enough time for yourself. Even if you heal, do you think you could get out of uh, range of the Simpho Key's reach? Oh, I could. I could escape. Oh, I could. I could escape, but that's not the problem. Um, oh, that's a good. Just went for this to cooperate with me. Um, someone I really don't want to deal with is almost here. Ooh, who's that? I have to move quickly before he arrives. Is this really it? Is this really all that life is in the end? A thousand years chasing after you, and it's all going to be over this easily? Do you want help, brother? Um, brother? Did I just hear someone say that? Damn it. You were the last person I wanted help from. Fred Trouble! Oh, shit! 
I do not have a good feeling about this. Hmm. Look at you, Rigger. This is why I told you not to turn him. Too late for that now. If you meant it, you should have tried harder to stop me back then, Erd. Oh, shit. What? Do you... Wait! That's fucking Rigger's brother? What? Do you want my help, Rigger? Yes, help me. Oh, boy! This is bad, Crowley! Oh, shit! This is bad! Oh, my God! So what? So not only is Sido alive, but a.k.a. Rigger Stafford, but his brothers come here! Oh, my fucking God! Like, you gotta wonder how, like, high on the troll god hierarchy this this motherfucker is. Like, Jesus Christ! Oh my god, Rigger's dead! You know what? This makes up for Mika's backstory and shit because this shit just got even more fucking interesting! This has gotta be Rigger's older brother! This has to be Rigger's older brother! The only reason why the argument could be made that this is Rigger's younger brother is Kai Luke it was turned by um by uh for red but I again could be wrong. But man, oh my god, that motherfucker is Rigger's brother. Oh my god. I can't believe I can't believe this shit. And God. And yes, I know for Red's backstory was kind of short. But. God. There's got to be a reason why we're getting this instead of the Mika content. This all has to tie together somehow. All of it has to tie in together. I can't wait to see how it does. <gasps> oh my fucking God. Oh my god, Rick, I'm down! Oh god, this chapter was amazing! Oh my god. I don't hate this chapter. I don't. I the only thing that I cut um that I wish was there, and I think Xeno wishes was here too, right, Kitty? Why Keith? Was, um, I wish we would have seen, like, the moment, uh, Fred was t let, turned into a vampire, because they keep talking about it, but it wasn't mentioned. I mean, it's, it wasn't shown. Right, kitties? Right, kitties? Right? Yeah. Oh, kitty love mama. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive so I can keep bringing you more um, Seraph of the End content, there's a few ways you could do that. You can donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, GoFundMe. Purchase something on my Amazon wishlist. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, find me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye!